Welcome back to We Changes series on feminist literacy. I'm Carla from Mortar J. So remember last week we did a talk about the different type of feminism them. This week we're gonna talk about the myth them. I'm a day I figure you know the truth. We found one set of smaddy in the world people love to tell life on a feminist. People tell more life on feminists than all them tell life on Eddie can bad stomach when the party flap on them one left. So like what talk about them. Myth number one. Feminists hate men and want women to be more powerful than them. Feminists don't hate men. Feminists want gender equality. It is about better lives for women and men. But feminists do have to talk about issues of power, which means that they have to critique men as a social group, which is different from attacking individual men. So look on it that way, me black. We could have a white partner and some beautiful half-white picnic. While loving them, I can still recognize I live in a system where white people have too much power and it can mash up the thing. So I can critique the system, white people as a social group, without hating my actual family. It's the same thing with feminists and men. Myth number two, all feminists are lesbians. Lie. Sexual orientation has nothing to do with being feminist. All types of people are feminists. Straight women, gay women, bi women, trans women, men, like masculine men, like the type of man when we are construction boots and walk on work site. The only thing a person has to do to be feminist is to care about the equality of women. That whole feminists are lesbians thing is more something that the media came up with to keep women away from the movement. Myth number three, men can't be feminists. Men definitely can be feminists and they should. Gender equality would benefit men too. Like for example, trans men could have their actual gender reflected on their ID. And maybe one of them there, yeah, a straight man wouldn't have to pay for the date. In this society, not all men are created equal and feminism can help with that. Myth number four, feminism isn't necessary anymore because women are equal. The feminist movement has made a lot of advances. Many women can vote, most women go to school, but we're still not there yet. For example, ask any man, what are you afraid of when you're walking alone at night? He'll say getting robbed. If you ask a woman, she'll say she's afraid of getting robbed and of getting raped. Even though more women are working outside of the home, they're still expected to do most of the work inside of it. On average, a man will do about seven hours of housework each week, a woman will do 14. Plus, feminism isn't just about equality on the basis of gender, it's about class, race, and sexual orientation, and we are nowhere near done with that. So make sure you come back next episode when we're gonna bring it closer to home and talk about the development of feminism in the Caribbean context.